this uh, this place is complete devastation. I have never seen anything to this extent in my life. Toto, I have a feeling we're not in Kansas anymore. Last night, there was a tornado that passed just a couple miles away from our house. I was actually out of town, and I drove in um, to check on my family. We got a little bit of stuff down on my property, but not much. To it, I mean, the the path of this thing is crazy. It's like a, uh, it's got to be close to 100 miles. It went all the way from Skyatook, Oklahoma, hit Owasso. Uh, Prior, Salina, um, Kenwood, and then it just kept moving into uh, Arkansas. Hey guys, how you doing? Uh, we're on our way to Rogers, Arkansas. I say we were, it's me, uh, Kevin from the Boring Channel and Jay's Lawn Care Obsessions. We're all going down to help my stepmom. Uh, the tornado hit her house, tore the roof off. They're talking about bulldozing the house. So we're going down there to help her get what she can get out of the house. And, uh, Send, uh, send us some prayers and some love.
guys, the devastation. People picking up their lives everywhere. Look at this, guys. I know, I'm driving, but I'm being careful. Everybody calm down. This is uh, kind of a very sad drive for me because I'm going to my stepmom's house and She's lost everything <clears throat> except what we can pull out of the house because they're going to bulldoze it within a matter of a day or two. It's crazy how Mother Nature can uh, take this house and skip that house. It's just uh, crazy. This neighborhood got hit pretty good. Yep. I'm assuming his mom lives pretty close. This is just crazy. So this uh, this place is complete devastation. I have never seen anything to this extent in my life. Uh, and, um, it's just absolutely wild. Yeah. Guys, we're in uh, my mom's house. Roger was in this back bedroom. Oh, and uh, we're trying to salvage whatever we can. And I don't know exactly what all we're going to be able to take. It is uh, 
it's something else, guys. Um, just uh, one crazy event. I bought that grandfather clock from my mom, or she helped me buy it when I worked my first job at J.C. Penney's in California. Well, this is, this is what it looks like. And I don't think mom's even seen it yet. It's incredible that my stepdad was in this house and walked out. I was watching over him, guys. Underneath this pile is a 56 Ford Lightning. And it was a gorgeous truck, and it's gone, guys. They're going to destroy it. Uh, 1955, I know that. It only has 2,300 miles on it. Oh, my gosh. 56. 1956. Guys, I didn't even recognize mom's neighborhood. She said they had 13 people in here. They all rode it out in the house, too. Oh, my gosh. Their house doesn't look nearly as bad as this one. They rode that out in the, uh, in the um, washer-dryer room. Oh, my gosh. The kids were upstairs when it hit. Really? Yeah. Did they live? Yeah, they made it down the stairs. There's glass everywhere. They were barefoot. They all got handed. Well, guys, it's about all we can do because the weather's fixing to change. Don, do you remember this? I don't want to be stuck with nowhere to go. Yeah, we probably got to get going, guys. Let's follow them to wherever. So just two months ago, I was here power washing the concrete. Sorry about the movement, guys. This is my stepmother, my adopted mom's house. It's a shame. Dad and I are going to jump in the truck. We're going to go see what's going on. I imagine so the thing is with tornadoes, it's not just tree damage. It's you got trash and shrapnel and stuff that was just thrown. And so what I'm going to do is um, we'll load the dump trailer. And from there, we'll just bring the stuff back here, put it on the burn piles, burn it off. If there's metal and stuff, I'll just clean it up later. It is what it is. I got the dump trailer, so I can always... Um, just burn it off and then get a, um, a skid steer out here later. Load it in the dump trailer and take it. I'm gonna dig a big hole and put it in the hole. Kid. Um, so, yeah. Let's, uh, let's see Rachel real quick. Yes. What was your experience last night? Having the shelter, I mean, it made me feel safe. How was it? I haven't had to go in there yet. It wasn't loud like I thought it would be at all. Oh, how was it in there, you mean? It smelled musty. I couldn't smell anything last night. Oh, yeah, that's right. You're sick. Was it musty? Yeah. Well, I'm 
answer was horrible. Well, I laid it. We had to train it a little bit. Maddie I, said it was yeah, horrible. We had, we had I had to use the restroom the whole time. We had yeah, spiders too. everywhere. We, we'll, we'll fix that, though. Yeah, yeah okay. spiders it, They're not a pleasant place to go, but it's better than being exposed to the tornado. Maddie, how was your first tornado experience? It was horrible. Yeah? Were you, were you shaking? Yeah. Oh, my goodness. I, I don't know. Try to show me how hard you were shaking. <clears throat> Let's see it. I don't know. I can't make. Huh? My arms are doing this. You were doing that? Yeah. yeah. I can show and my you. She was. I was holding her nose. <laughs> uh, I remember uh, and I riding out. The I remember riding out some big storms in the storm cellar. Oh cellar when I was a kid. I'd, I'd get shaking too. Of course, when I grew up, I saw the movie Twister. <laughs> that movie gave me nightmares. Many of you ever seen Twister? Yeah, and I don't want to. You have seen it? Uh, no. It's even worse at this point. No? We should watch it. No. I love that movie. I literally don't it's a it good movie. To a kid growing up in uh, Kansas, we're in Tornado Alley. You hear that all the time, too. I have a feeling we're not in Kansas anymore. And we were. They're saying <laughs> Tornado Alley's moved. So we, me and Grandma decided that we're gonna put like a tote down there with water, cans. Smart move. Um, Smart move. Yeah. We can put some shelves up in there. Survival food. We had to put it up in a shelf instead of a tote. Why? That well, might be good. That's how we had it. Of course, we need, to, we need to bomb that real good. Yeah. Because yeah. when we first moved here, I saw black widows down there. Oh, shoot. Well, I killed several spiders. Um, and several I didn't. Yeah. I do like the fact that it has a backup light down there, so it never got dark. That's cool. When the electric went off, the backup light came on. It never got dark. That would have been terrifying if I had been a child. Yeah. And it probably would have been terrifying with all the spiders as an adult. <laughs> oh, yeah. And oh, yeah. I was the one who got the backup light in the house. So, what are you yeah. and Mom doing? Are you guys going to Tulsa? Yeah. Since it has power. You're going to play with the kids in Tulsa? Uh, no. Oh, uh, what? I'm going to clean up tornado stuff, and you guys are going to party at the gathering place? If you haven't been to the gathering place in Tulsa, Oklahoma, I highly suggest it. It's the top rated park in the U.S. right now. want to hit up side streets right here uh we've got a brush pile over here we don't know where the uh launch is uh, uh, what, load load right here. or whatever yeah, whatever you guys want man okay i've got i've got a couple guys working debris on these side streets let me figure out where they're at because okay. then we could just load y'all up yeah and they, they're running some saws over there let me call him i got a property pair that's close to here so we can take Brush. We'll take trash, whatever you need. We'll just burn it all off, and then whatever's left afterwards, we'll just clean Thank it up. Perfect. Thank you, guys. All right. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
we're figuring out where we're gonna go. Look at this. Nice. Yeah. Appreciate you guys coming out. Uh, yeah, man. Y'all know where West Frontier is? Just a couple streets. I'll figure it out. Okay. You figure it out? You'll see them. <laughs> they got skits here They got red shirts. All right. Perfect. Thank you. This is okay. Well, it's still got a roof on it. Luckily, it's a tree. Oh, tree God, look at all the, the toys other. and stuff in the backyard. The tree fell over the other way and locked them in. Yeah. probably is this uh loading dock over here we got a brush pile right there going okay. and uh, grda say that we can dump stuff there so oh, okay you'll see you'll see Perfect. you know where that boat ramp is over here yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. you'll see the brush pile all right so go to frontier just go to frontier and just start throwing stuff back to the trailer all right cool you guys good back there y'all good You guys will have to tell me where to go. Yeah. A little more comfortable over there, huh? No, thankfully. She got here a couple of years ago. Um, and when it missed Salina, it hit her, but now it hit here, it missed her. Yeah, let me know where. Um, okay. Uh, I can't. There's a line down over there. Oh, okay. So right, right here. Okay. Right, then take a left. Yeah, All right. Yeah, I tried going down that street earlier. Dang it. Oh yeah, they got slammed over here. I came through 
This tree fell on their house. They gotta wait until the insurance. But yeah, it's looking rough. And then over here, we got a lot of that cut up. We're leaving the stuff around the car, same thing. Waiting, taking pictures, getting a hold of insurance. Um, we got a lot moved out.